how to update your DBS. If this is your DBS, just pretend this is your real DBS that you received through the post. We will send you a update link. You will see this on your screen, it's your surname. Now what you need to do is you need to type your surname in there, insert your surname, it needs to be exactly the same as what it says on your surname. So what's your surname on, on here? It will say your surname, it will say whatever your name is. You need to type your surname, whatever's in there. So it will go straight into the surname section. Now select your gender, male or female, enter your date of birth in there. So your email address, Type your email address in there again. Enter your mobile phone in there. I would normally put a mobile phone in there. This is very important now. Application reference number. What we need to put in there is your <coughs> certificate number. Can you see the certificate number there? There. Okay. Now the second important step is you need to click on where it says use my certificate number instead. Certificate number. Can you see when it says certificate number? Once you've entered your certificate number and you clicked on certificate number you need to click on here and select no you need to then click on continue you need to click on accept terms and conditions and then you need to click on continue payment page what you need to do is you need to type your number in there your expiry date your security number and then make sure you click on this box here it's very important automatically they will take 13 pounds automatically to renew your DBS update service every year. Move your payments uh, on your app, you'll be presented with a screen. Your subscription has been confirmed, the payment has gone through. It's very, very important that you take a picture of this or screenshot the whole thing. And this is the number that you need to note down. Once you're done, that's it. DBS has been updated.